it's been an evolution. It we, has. We were in a five-piece kind of glamabilly, folk, rock and roll, you know, somewhere between folk and rockabilly. And then we wanted to explore something more modern. So yeah. this band takes some of that sound and incorporates more modern elements, uh, uh, some sample drums, uh, synthetic keyboards and different sounds. It's got a little bit more of a, a bite and a modern yeah. kind of edge. I feel like we were, it's like the favorite bits of every genre that we love all mashed together. Right. Different eras. Through a filter, and then it's our sound. Yeah, yeah. Each era has, whether it's like blue, you know, Howlin' Wolf, like 50s blues, to like 60s garage with the kinks and uh, the zombies and stuff like that. 70s glam rock. You're going to go through all the well, eras. <laughs> but like Bowie, T Rex, um, 80s. You're like, like 18s. Prince <laughs> and uh, 90s, you know, you had the whole kind of alt movement yeah. and. But we kind of listen to everything, so we try and blend little bits of the things we love. Yeah, make for sure. Make it a sound that's combining it all. Yeah. <laughs> Polars, which is kind of our last name slash my last name. She actually wouldn't take my last We're name. Married. We're married. Just to clear that up, because yeah. that could be a lot of things. A lot of times they're like, are you guys brother, brother and, and sister? sister? Like, why were you kissing backstage? <laughs> um, we're not that kind of band. <laughs> um, so we are married, yeah. and she wouldn't take my name in marriage. I like my name. So I was like, all right, how about... We named the band, and she was like, all right, fine, I'll compromise. Yeah. Um, so, and then the sound, she drums, taps, has this whole percussive octopus human being element to the band, and I do all the producing and play guitar and sing, yeah. and we come together to make a sound. To make one. Uh, it's like, I never imagined I'd be doing this. I never imagined I'd be tap dancing for as long as I have now. I always loved it, but I didn't think it was going to be my profession as an adult. Um, so I was starting with, a t I've been a tap dancer since I was a kid. And then in our other band, we had a drummer. And I would tap dance alongside with him. I didn't know how to play the drums yet. This was about seven or eight years ago. Mm -hmm. And then our drummer quit. And instead of getting a new drummer, Rob's idea was for me to learn the drums but keep the tap dancing. So it just it took a lot of work, a lot of like angry sticks thrown across oh, the yeah, room, tears, tears like, why am I doing me. this? Just a lot of hate directed at him. But you know, the way we actually, the way it happened in the beginning, the very beginning, is my sister and I were on, I was playing acoustic and we were working on this song and Lauren had just bought a pair of tap shoes because she'd missed it and wanted to get back into it. And she was, there happened to be like a hardwood floor in the living room and she started just tapping along with the rhythm and we started playing and it just sort of happened naturally and then we had a show in a couple of days and we were like, uh, you want to come perform? And so we grabbed a piece of wood like behind a trash can, dusted off the spider webs, threw it down, put a mic on it and Lauren was like the percussionist in the beginning. And I really, and I haven't stopped. Yeah. It's just evolved. It's we just keep, evolved. I keep adding new drums, throw new drums at her. She's like, no, 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 no more, more drums. <laughs> we have an album coming out yeah, in March. In March 2017. Vinyl and digital and USB. No, and no CD. No CD. Probably not. We might. Oh. Just, well, yeah. I just, I feel like. Do, do, I feel like they, CDs are on their way out, well, and I feel like it's been a long time. You're like, oh hey, epiphany. <laughs> <laughs> I'm like, I feel like <laughs> I'm gonna make that announcement. I'm gonna make that call right here. You heard it first. <laughs> <laughs> um, 
uh, yeah, yes. album. Anyways, album, album, album out. out. We planning on going to Europe, which is exciting. Just Hopefully, touring, a lot of touring. touring. Being on the road, seeing this country, seeing other countries, hanging out together. Yeah. More hot tubs. Yeah, more hot tubs. <laughs> International hot tubs. Hopefully. <laughs> Instagram is kind of the hot spot yeah. now, I think. Instagram, Facebook, we have a website. Yeah, Instagram is Kolar's band, is me, and Lauren is now LB Tap Drum. I keep changing it every day. I don't know what my LB handle Tap is. LB Tap Drum, I think, is hers. <laughs> so we each have one. Mine is kind of the band one, but hers also does band stuff. And then, yeah, Facebook, Instagram, website. I said Instagram. Okay, I'm just going through the... the that's good. Uh, that's pretty much... That's it. That's pretty much where it's at. Like, you tweet, oh, but, YouTube, like, you don't tweet YouTube. a lot. We have videos we have YouTube. YouTube yeah. Yeah. Hi, I'm Lauren. I'm Rob. And you've, you've just, just been, been buzzed. buzzed. Hey, everybody. Thanks so much for watching. Don't forget to subscribe to our channel. Bye.